The Flute Calibration 700 HPPK Pneumatic Test Pump Kit generates and adjusts pneumatic pressures up to 21 megapascal, 3000 psi, without requiring a nitrogen bottle or other external pressure supply. It supplies pressure for the testing of transmitters, controllers, pilots, digital and analog gauges, and more. It's the perfect solution for generating high pressure in the field, where conditions and operating surfaces can vary. The 700 HPPK is the ideal choice for calibration technicians and test engineers working in oil and gas, process, aerospace, and defense who need a simple, safe, and dependable pressure source. The 700 HPPK contains both a calibration manifold and high pressure pump to generate and finally adjust pressures. Setting up the 700 HPPK is easy. Place it on almost any surface and open the legs to stabilize it. Make sure the vent valve at the bottom of the pump is completely closed. Connect the calibration manifold to the pump bracket. Quick detent pins make the manifold easy to connect and disconnect. Connect one end of the first hose to the port at the base of the pump. Now wind the hose around the bracket hooks and connect the other end to the inlet port on the calibration manifold. Connect the second hose to the unit under test with the standard fittings provided with the 700 HPPK. Connect the other end to the test port on the calibration manifold. Connect the reference gauge to the reference port on the calibration manifold. No PTFE tape is required to make the connection. Make sure the inlet valve on the calibration manifold is open and the two vent valves are closed. Pump the 700 HPPK to generate pressure. Generally, you can generate 21 megapascal, or 3000 psi, within 20 seconds if you pump with full strokes. When the applied pressure gets close to the highest targeted pressure, close the inlet valve. This helps to stabilize the pressure. Use the variable volume control to adjust the pressure and achieve the exact target pressure on the reference gauge. Take readings from the reference gauge and the test gauge. Use the vent valve to slowly reduce the pressure to the next pressure reading. Keep the inlet valve closed if you are not using the pump. Use the variable volume control to make fine pressure adjustments. When you have completed the tests, open the vent valve to release all the pressure that may be built up in the pump.